Odd against Hamcam, Norwegian Elite Assyrian match this Saturday, 5 pm kickoff time in the UK. Tough match, this one, to predict. I'm not actually going to have a bet in this fixture uh, because I don't know which way it's going to go. Because, I mean, Odd themselves are one of the most difficult teams to predict in the entire league. You never know which version of Odd is going to show up. They are now in eighth position on 30 points. I do wonder if at some point soon they might be a candidate to sort of relax a bit and be on the beach. When Certainly when they think they've got enough points on the board anyway, I, I sense that that's what's going to happen to this team. Um, but they are unbeaten in four games. They've picked up 10 uh, points in those four fixtures and things are going all right for Odd. Of course, the big story last week was the 18-year-old Dennis Gengar picking up two goals uh, away against Sandefjord. He did look good. I'd imagine he'll probably start again. And uh, But let's just stop, let's not forget, it was Sandefjord that they faced. Sandefjord have conceded 50 goals. Jürgen Sandefjord, the last two games, the easiest two matches you can have right now. And uh, Hamcam, despite winning, uh, losing their last two, you know, it's worth mentioning all season, they've only lost one match by more than a one-goal margin. This this team is not easily beaten. And my big concern is how much mental baggage they've got from this Sarpsborg defeat where they were leading 1-0, heading into injury time, and they lost. Um, I felt last week they could have got something against Viking. On another day, they might have even won the game, but they ended up losing it. Things are going against Hamcam at the moment, and when a side, when that's happening to a team... You've got to be very careful if you're going to back them um, because my gut feeling is they actually get something out of this game. Hamcam have drawn 11 matches this season out of 22 away from home. They've only lost three times, six draws out of 10. And uh, I would go with a draw, but um, I'm not going to take anything. I think the goal line is about is quite fair between 2.5, 2.75. I think both teams scoring at 1.63 is again about fair. The Asian handicap plus a half. I did consider this on uh, Hamcam, 1.81. I did really consider it. But fundamentally, I just can't trust them right now. I'd like to see them get a result here because I think they're a backable team towards the end of the season. But this match, I'm going to leave it alone.